We continue following breaking news in Kansas City, Kansas this midday. Procter & Gamble announced it will close its KCK plant in 2020. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan is at the plant right now. Uh, Charlie, what are workers telling you? Well, Cynthia, employees told me that there had been rumors swirling around for weeks that this facility here in Kansas City, Kansas would be shutting down. So they were almost thankful to get the news today to put those rumors to bed, but of course unhappy that the result is that those rumors were true, that they'll be losing their jobs or forced to transfer within Procter & Gamble. Although one employee told me, hey, it's better to find out now than to show up one morning to a locked door. Now, this closure will impact 280 full-time employees and another 350 contract employees all working here at the KCK plant. They'll either have to transfer or find a new job come mid-2020. The Procter & Gamble will move the dish soap operation, which currently takes place here, to its new facility in West Virginia. The plant manager broke the news to a, his employees during a facility-wide meeting this morning. I spoke to one man who was in that meeting who said that his boss told them that he had been dreading this day for weeks. The plant manager said that he'd been working on a speech and trying to memorize it all night. And in the end, he threw that away and just spoke. So he, it wasn't a canned speech. It was genuine answers. So the other answer is why close this facility, you know, after all? Well, Procter & Gamble says it did a, a big study, a big survey of all of its facilities and determined that it just needed to find better ways to improve the efficiencies of its production and distribution. And that meant moving and consolidating locations to a West Virginia plant that has uh, more space for production and better access to distributors in that area. Just something that could not be accomplished here in KCK. If you're curious, this plant is at uh, Kansas Avenue, Highway 32, right at 18th Street Expressway. Reporting in KCK, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News.